Warp 84 here bringing a box reveal. It is my monthly box that I get and it's from the Bandbox company. This month I switched it from the pop culture to the um, horror box. So that'll be next month's box that comes in. This one was the pop culture. So stay tuned. do let's uh, open the box um, this month's theme was Batman John Wick and the new spider-man movie so I'm super excited to see what I got let's open her up and um, I'm using a box cutter no knives so it's gonna be safe and just to show you hasn't even opened yet, so I have no clue what's inside. That's what they did like they did with the last box. Yep. Which I love that they did that. So it still keeps you guessing. It's awesome. Alright, so where to start? Should we start with this big box right here, which I'm going to assume is a pop? Or should we start with the smaller stuff? Now, let's go with the pop. What do you think? Don't go with the rest of the stuff. So. Let's put that off to the side. And then, are you ready for the reveal? I'm super excited. I don't know, I don't know what it's going to be. Let's see. Not what I thought it was going to be. So a little, not disappointed, but caught off guard. So it is another Shazam pop signed by one of the artists again. So This makes my second Shazam pop. Let me get this in here properly real quick. So it comes with a protector again, like last time. And with the certificate on top, showing that the artist that uh, signed it was Faith Herman, who plays Darla Duddy off of the movie Shazam, which I still have not seen yet. So, but now I have Pedro and Darla both signed. So, I mean, they're not big superstars, but it's still pretty cool to get an autographed pop from, you know, an actress. Whether it be a kid or an adult or an old person, still pretty cool. So I am gonna admit that it did catch me off guard, especially the themes that were on the box for this month. So, but overall, pretty cool. Now I have another one to add my collection for Shazam. So let's go through the rest of it. Let's go see what they gave me. All right, so a pen. Uh, this looks like Mysterio. Got myself another pen. It's pretty cool. It's got like a twinkling stars on his mask part. It's 
So it's pretty interesting. It's pretty cool. All right, what's next? Some kind of coin that I honestly don't know what it belongs to. I have no clue. Hopefully they got the little pamphlet in there that tells you what all of it is. Hmm. Yep, they do. Alright, cool. Ooh. Alright, so. I never pay attention to the John Wick movies. This is a John Wick gold coin prop. The only currency you need at the Continental Hotel is one of these gold coins. Now you can pay your bar tab on higher cleanup. So. This one was John Wick. This one was the sign pop. This one belonged to Spider-Man. That means there's only at least one more thing. And I'm not going to read what it says on here. So. That. That's pretty cool. That's pretty awesome, actually. So this is out of 3,000 made. I have 632. Number 632. But that's pretty cool. I think, I think my man Shane from Big Kids Small Toys is going to appreciate that. And once again, it is a certificate of authenticity showing that it is real, that it's not fake. All this stuff is 100% real. Um, this is a signed fan art print. First time BAM artist Sam Zalk, or Zach, or Zalk, murdering it no matter what. Brings us darkness. Look for the zombie variant numbered out of only 500. Unfortunately, I didn't get the zombie one. That would have been awesome. But I did get one of them. And that's pretty cool. So see, here's a little pamphlet that tells you what each one of them are. So overall, I'm happy with it. I'm hoping for like a... Honestly, to be you know like a Spider-Man pop or a John Wick pop, maybe getting you know signed by Keanu Reeves or um, one of the Spider-Man you know actors and stuff like that. But still pretty cool. Now I don't, you know now I have another collector item for a signed pop from Shazam. Um, that'll leave me Eugene, Shazam himself, Freddie, and Mary. So. Who knows, maybe I'll get an uh, um, entire collection of these, of all the actors uh, signed. But it won't be next month though, because like I said, I did switch to the horror box. Because the horror box next month is um, It Chapter 2, um, Annabelle, um, the Coming Home one or whatever it is, the, the newest one that came out. And then, um, I can't remember the last movie that was on there. It's a movie that's on Netflix. Um, can't place, I can't think of the name right now. I'll come to me after I'm done with this video, probably. But, alright, so, let's just go through it again. Darla from Shazam, signed by Faith Herman, the actress that uh, played her in the movie. Um, still haven't seen the movie, so don't know nothing about it. My little pin that represents the Spider-Man of this one, so it's Mysterio. John Wick's coin, 
and only currency in the Continental um, Bar, right? No, Continental Hotel. So that's pretty cool. And then a signed fan art by Sam Zock or Zach. Yeah, I think that's how you say it. Ah, anyways, pretty cool. Pretty awesome, right? So, like always, um, please subscribe to my channel and leave comments. And um, if you like the video, it's awesome. Uh, if uh, you have any questions or any suggestions, please leave them in the comments below. But, um, don't forget to, let me move this out of the way. So don't forget to check out my Instagram page. I also post stuff on there um, when I'm going to make videos and post videos and such, and then just random, you know, posts. So, uh, without further ado, uh, Big Smurf 84 here. Love making the video for you guys. Hope you enjoyed my last one. And, um, until next time. Bye, everybody.